What's going on people? I'm Mr Midas and I'm here with Flavour Magazine and Brothers With No Game to discuss a Valentine's special on relationships and dating. I have a Wicked UK panel here with me today and we're going to find out their point of view and give you some advice. Okay, I'm going to introduce you to the dating panel, aka my dating groups. I'm Fem Fem, I'm a UK rapper. Jamie Howard, I'm on Twitter. Ralph Hardy, all Ram Langers. Slim Comedian, South London. Okay, my first question is what is the first date commandments? What rules, what protocols should you always have on your first date? Fellas? True, man. And I'm on rule with Dougie, the guy should pay. You agree with that, fellas? On the first date, the guy was paying. No, it depends, it depends if the guy has asked the girl out, though. Yeah. If, if I say to a girl, oh, I think we should go here, yeah. then I suggested it, I should pay. But if it's a mutual thing, why should you pay? So she's chilling at I mean, home and she's saying, bro, should we go to Nando's? Chivalry, obviously, you can't. Can't. she is. If she acts like she, yeah, I have to pay, then she could pay herself, but you know. I'm not even going to lie, once I went out with uh, my model from the scene, and we went out to right. eat, all right. All right. Yeah, as you do, <laughs> I'm more than see. And, um, and we went out to eat, and as soon as the bill was coming, she didn't even wait until it came. As soon as the woman came up with the bill, she was like, oh, I need to go to the toilet. Rushed oh, off yes. to go to the toilet. I'm like, I call you out, big man, thing, I'll pay. As soon as she came back, she was like, so have you paid then? I wanted to dash the check in her face. I was kind of like that, and well, I didn't want to damage my card. Her face was a bit tough. Dude, but... You want to have a girl when her face was tough? Yes. I'm a bit like that. Mm. She just had a big bum, that's all I need. What's her name? Uh, mm. So come on, date rules. That's the only rule, the man have to pay. On time? Uh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, be on time. Don't, don't turn up late. Yeah, be chivalrous, open doors. No, it's like that. No way! This thing about girls automatically getting everything, rubbish. Not in 2000 and maybe 1950 something. <laughs> a girl has to earn a lot of stuff now. I'm yeah. not saying you mustn't be um, a, try and be a gentleman towards her. Well, then opening doors, this and that. You don't know, she might be the local whore around her neighborhood. <laughs> yeah. And man, see, look at that idiot opening the door for that sketch <laughs> <laughs> out. Yeah. What kind of background check do you do on a girl? Facebook, Twitter. Friends, that don't work, you know, because if a whole wants to stay hidden, she'll stay hidden, you know. They're like SAS. They don't want to do themselves when they want. But listen, peeps, I want to fuck this girl here. Yeah? yeah? Do any of you know that she's a slag? All right, on that note, on that note, I think that's the end of the first question. Okay, if you could all pick one female from the UK scene to take out on a date, who would it be and why? Adele. Yeah. She's got, she's, she's one of us. You know, Adele's the only fat girl I'd bang. Okay. Really, she is. She, she has, yeah. I like Cheryl Cole, I ain't gonna lie. Thank she's you. nice. Um, I like Jamelia. I think she's oh, Jamelia, yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. do, and I feel yeah. like her personality. The, uh, brum, the Brummy accent would annoy me though. No, no, I, love, I, love, yeah. I love so do I. I do, yeah. So oh, I don't nice. like the Brummy accent, it sounds silly. Warm plus horny? Nah, nah. Black, leave my Brummy people, man. Black girl with a Scouse accent. Um, it doesn't matter. Uh, the accent don't. Like, when they go kissing you up and you, <laughs> you think that you're hearing any accent? I think Rochelle from the Saturdays is hot. I think all of them are beautiful. <laughs> Every UK artist out there is beautiful. Some of them are more beautiful than others, but... Alright, uh, we're just going off track on this one. So we're going to wrap this up and say we can't come up with a top three, but we're definitely putting Jamelia in there. Yeah. Alright? Right. Heskey's a good footballer, a good guy, the link-up man, but very rarely does he score, and when he does, it's usually very sloppy. Some guys can relate to that character sense, always being in a friend zone and always considered a good guy, but very rarely gets the girl in the end. Have you ever been in a Heskey zone? Okay, what I want to know now is have any of you lot been hesky? I think I think every I think everyone's liked a girl that has been unattainable. Like yeah, yeah. yeah, or liked a friend. But I've never been that guy where someone's phoned and gone, oh can you come and pick me up? And I've gone, oh, oh no can you way. come round? No and way. then I've had to be the shoulder that they cry or take them to another guy's house that no, no way. See, I've been hesky myself. When I was young I was mad shy. That's when you're young, isn't it? Mad shy. And I used to there used to be a lot of girls and I always used to get 
you're just my friend. I used to get that a lot. And I think I was a Hesky when I was younger, but that was the whole, I first admit, but that was the whole, because I was really shy and quite mm. insecure. That's what it is. The man lives in the hole. When a woman gets that, she thinks, oh, because she's that special. She is attractive to the guy, but he's living in hope one day, he can beat you. That's why he does that. If he knew from the start, how much man knew from the start? Boom, you're never getting none of this. I'm <laughs> telling you now, but that's I'll why sign I something in that. Do you know how much woman would lose money? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A, a man spending money on them? Mm -hmm. What, definite? What, I've signed the form to say that I'm not getting, not even a sniff of it. Cool. Oh, I got a hit once, actually, when I was in America. Met this girl in a club, and I had a car. So she's like, oh yeah, like, we should all go back to uh, my... Uh, so I was like, okay, cool. I was like, yeah, sick. <laughs> so we jumped in the car, got to theirs, and she gave me a kiss in the cheek and went, thanks for dropping me home. <laughs> but I was in a foreign country, so I didn't know the, the history <laughs> etiquette. It's my, that's my defense. <laughs> play a pivotal role, yeah? Without the Heskies, there aren't a Michael Owens, yeah? yeah. I'm not a Heskey, I would. So, but without Heskey, there isn't us. So, as as long as there's us, there will always be the Heskies. Yeah. And you know what, for my sake, God bless the Heskies. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> That's a wicked way to end up. Alright, that's a wrap. The panel gave us some great advice for you brothers out there with no game. A lot of interesting facts for the ladies too. So, I'm Mr Midas. This has been Flavour Magazine. Brothers with no game, Valentine's special. Have a good one. Like, be honest, be yourself, and you may get a girl one day. Jamie? Just think, yeah, just, just be you, have confidence in, in who you are. Read a book, watch the news, um, just, just just have faith, don't play the Hesky role. Um, and if there are any girls out there watching as well, um, girls with, with no game or with game, guys have two emotions, hungry and horny. So as long as you have those two things captured, if you're not sexing me, make me a sandwich. <laughs> if you're not making me a sandwich, sex me. And that is the guide to eternal happiness. <laughs> Ralph? Yeah, um, yeah, be yourself, unless you're a dickhead, then don't be <laughs> yourself. Like, just read up, be intelligent, have conversations, be funny, do do whatever the guy failing is not doing. Yeah. Slim, final four. Um, for the guys, pick a girl that is interested in you. Do you get what I mean? If you've got to go through so, if you have to do so much things because you think this girl ain't gonna like me unless I do it, she ain't the girl for you. Try and pick someone that you're more matched to. If you're an idiot, find an idiot. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? If she's fit, find someone. If you're fit, find someone who's fit. Find someone, find someone, find someone that you can relate common to. Ground. Yeah, common ground that you can relate to without feeling the need that you have to try and outthink her to get her, really. <laughs>